Hi, hello, how are you? It's Sunday, December 13th at 9.16 in the morning. And I just woke up and took a shower and got up and I'm getting dressed so I can go car shopping today. I've been looking for a car for a while. I literally just got my permit in November and I get my license in February. And since I'm moving to a city that requires a car and I you know what kind of car I want, I want a Honda Civic Sport hatchback because they're just really cute, really durable, very affordable, you know, for a first car. I'm gonna be going with my dad, stepdad, and my mom and my sister to the Honda dealership today. We're going at 12.45 and I'm about three hours before then so I have until about 12 to get ready and yeah I'm gonna go ahead and throw on the rest of my outfit which is this black playboy hoodie that I literally cannot get enough of and I'm layering up today and putting on this red and black flannel on top of it so let me go ahead and throw this on don't wanna wear that tonight I wanna get nasty I literally have been streaming positions since it came out I rarely ever stream anything else I co-washed my hair this morning um and I kind of forgot how much hair I had and I literally have to do all of this myself no government assistance today I'm definitely wearing my contacts definitely popping those in. I'm gonna be doing my makeup gonna be wearing the lashes I need to do a hairstyle that makes me look older and I think I already know what hairstyle I'm gonna do there's a down style I showed this hairstyle on my TikTok first but there's gonna be a little variation to it today go ahead and get ready um this is what the outfit I have to show you the updated outfit out <laughs> Okay, so I'm about to go ahead and do my hair first because I'm gonna let that air dry and then diffuse it a little bit and then we're gonna do my makeup. Makeup. Makeup time! So I just finished the hard part which was my eyebrows and I turn around for two seconds and I hear my dad speaking to Cashew saying Aaliyah is gonna get you. What did he do? Cashew decided to eat my beauty blender and he also decided to smuggle one of my makeup brushes out of the room while I wasn't looking. I really, really, really want to wear contacts today, but I don't know if I have any on me. Cause I don't, okay, let me cut it out with the British accent. Um, I literally just got new glasses and contacts like not even a month ago, so I'm still adjusting. I'm gonna see if I have any because I really wanted to wear them. It's currently 10.38 and we don't have to leave here till like 12, so I got dressed pretty quickly. It's a tie between these Ardell Platinum Princess Lashes. These look really cute on me. Or these Ardell Faux Mink Wispies. Don't ask me why the security tag is on here. And I, oh! Don't ask me on my son nothing. So I decided to do a little voiceover for this part of the video just so you guys like the entire process and what to expect when you go to a dealership. So when we first got there, we started talking to a worker, Lorenzo, he was top tier. He showed us a 2021 car because they didn't have any 2020s left in stock in the state that I actually wanted. We started viewing the car, the color, you know, I got to sit in it, the inside, everything. Um, we got to test drive it and it felt amazing. I fell in love with it and I decided this is the car that I wanted. Despite them not having the original one, I love this way more than the one I originally got. But I actually decided on getting the car that day and because of this I was able to go ahead and start working on customization because of financing in the line in front of us uh, it took a while for them to actually get to us. When it came to customization Honda has a lot of safety features with just like the key fobs and the locks and everything so that's just what we did because that's just what Honda does and I did do this at a Honda dealership. All this information we definitely had to give a lot of informa information to get a lot of information back because like with our license number and everything and um, we were there for actually five hours so we definitely had to get a food break which is what uh, we were doing at this part of the video he's break in the car here go maya cashew it's starting on me i didn't just had a wendy's break we started talking to the financial guy at the honda hendrick and he just explained warranties plans payments uh leasing and just how many months i would pay for it uh, i got my keys and the car was mine now this is basically the rundown and very simplistic version i'm pretty sure there's very much more detailed version on youtube but yeah that's my experience oh. Yep. set up a camera in a car ah. first of all problems okay so i started vlogging my car like process and vlog yesterday when i was at the dealership y'all thought i was gonna fumble a bag with that oh my god there's so much 
going on? I am going to be setting up my car in all of its settings. So I'm gonna answer some questions as well. So first things first, I got a 2021 Honda Civic Sport in the color Sonic Gray. I went, I originally wanted the polished metallic dark gray. They didn't have any, and I was like, okay, I'll see the Sonic Gray. And when I tell you, as soon as I saw this color, I freaked the out because it's just so hot. Like this car is so cute for what? It's so attractive. And for what? I don't know. The color is cute. I feel like it fits my personality. I bought it with 14 miles on it. I put down half the money and I'm financing the rest of it, just paying it off slowly and probably gonna pay it off ahead of time. It is the hatchback version because I didn't really like the way the sedan looked. I just really like the way the hatchback looks. It has less view for me to see, but that's what mirrors are for, ladies. I need to give you a haul of everything I bought for my car. Now, I have had this stuff bought for so long. I finally got it! I got it! I finally got it! First thing I got were some masks. I'm ordering more masks because these are about to be empty. I need masks, like we're in a pandemic, what the fuck? And then the next thing I got was like this portable like vacuum that I'm probably gonna keep in the trunk or something like that just so I can keep my car clean because I'm very big on keeping things clean and I just don't like shenanigans whatsoever. I also just got an umbrella to keep in the car. It's yellow, like hello, it's really, really cute. Love it here. I'm using my own holder pocket to put in my car so I can just put it on the vent so I can just stick it somewhere in my car so when I have to look at like directions and stuff I gotta slip it in there with my uh phone holder that I sold for Black Friday and if you got to buy that thank you so much I appreciate you I also have calming shoes for cashews so when we're in the car he does not freak the hell out um I also got a bunch of things of black ice because I feel like I'm the only person in the world who doesn't like the smell of new cars so I'm actually gonna bust this out right now because i do not like the smell of black i don't like the smell of new car like i just i don't know why i just like black ice so much better or like those little febreze things that i'm probably gonna have in here too this car is gonna have like five thousand different smells how the hell do you even put this on period not the little tree anyway i also got myself a car mount for my camera because you guys do know i'm like a youtuber or something i don't know if you noticed and whatnot but like i do youtube and whatnot i just needed a car mount so i could screw in my camera um i got five thousand other things of black ice because it's my favorite scent um i also bought these blind spot mirrors that you can put on the side of your car and then i also got a life-saving usb charger basically what this is is it has like this little blade in here so you can cut your seat belt if you ever need to and there's this thing on here that if you're underwater you can break your window or break your windshield so you can swim out so you don't die there's a usb charger on it which i didn't know before i bought it but um i also got some cables to put in here um i also got a license plate frame and i don't have my official license plate yet but and it's literally black rhinestone either way i was gonna get black trimming on my car so i was like let me make the black trimming pop i don't have a basic color on top i'm not gonna have a basic license plate frame i'm so excited as you can see i also just got a regular usb thing and then i also got this car trash can which i really don't know if i'm gonna keep in here if i'm being honest with you just because it's kind of redundant like i'd rather just have a plastic grocery bag that's ghetto but it's what i want so like i don't know and then i also just decided to oh maya's coming so the last thing that i got was just this duffel bag that i'm gonna put spare clothes in just in case you know i get stranded and there's like a toothbrush and deodorant and stuff like that in here that's everything that i got for my car i think i'm gonna go ahead and start putting everything in its place and just stuff like that because girl i moved back to charlotte in less than a week so that means i'm gonna be busting the out in less than a week so i want it to be set and ready to can go as soon as possible one thing i'm not doing today is putting this damn license plate frame on because i don't have my license plate like what's why would i put a temporary license plate in it doesn't matter so i'm just gonna go ahead and get this going okay so i just turned the ac down so you guys don't hear things but i decided just aesthetically take it off Hate the noise, love the shininess of the dash, babe. So something I didn't do yesterday when we first got in the car was connect my phone, which I probably should do because I know we've got no key. I'm just gonna start putting stuff where it goes as we start messing with the car functions because that's just how I work all of a sudden. I have no idea how the music works in here, obviously. I guess it just doesn't wanna connect today. Is this gonna help anything? <laughs> okay, I think I got it. Okay. Okay, so now that we have that set up, um, I'm gonna put on some copyright free music so we can actually, I don't even care if this gets copyrighted. I really don't give a f um, I'm gonna go ahead and put this in here as well, just so I can keep my spare black ice on deck. I don't know what to do about this 
car mount for my camera. I feel like it depends because I film with a Canon G7X Mark III. The camera that I have has it where it flips up on the top. So I don't know if I put it on the dash, but it's gonna clunk clunk. Because I feel like the windshield would look one, cool as hell, and two, you get like a higher angle, if that makes any sense. Ah, uh, no, that's not, that's not gonna work at all. Um, ignore the trash in the back, not the car to being dirty. So, anyways. Just ignore it back. Something else I want to put in here is like a on-the-go camera battery charger, but I have to order that off Amazon just because it's a lot of to deal with. Man, I'm gonna whip this hoe. I'm just gonna keep this little thing under my cup holders, and you guys will see what I'm talking about when I say under my cup holders when I do my car tour. Here's my blind spot mirrors. I don't think I'm gonna put these on today just because it is rainy, and there are stickers on the back that actually attaches it to the car, and since it's raining, what the hell? Why would I put it on there and ruin it? Um, and I'm also gonna put this just in my glove box. This isn't the glove box. Armrest thingamabobber thing. Now, here's that um garbage thing that I was telling y'all about. I'm not decorating my car much because I need to be worried about driving instead of what my car looked like on the inside because I'm not gonna be looking at the inside of my car too much because I have to be looking at the outside so I can drive. This is the trash thing I was talking about. And I think I am gonna keep this in here. I think I'm gonna put it on the passenger seat just because I can't you know, do that all that shenanigans. I have instructions to set up a garbage can. This is what it looks like. Ubers have stuff like this. Not like regular drivers have this. I feel like Ubers have stuff like this. This was a waste of money. So before we actually get into this car tour, it is indeed a hot ass mess this entire end of the video. So if you like chaotic things, enjoy me and my sister looking like crackheads and total idiots for about 10 minutes. All right, there we go. All right, so it's not focused. Hi guys, so I am here about a week and a half, two weeks later, uh, here to give you my official car tour. I'm literally talking as loud as I possibly can, and I'm in my new neighborhood, so this is kind of awkward, but I'm just here to give you my tour of my 2021 Honda Civic Hatchback Sport in the shade Sonic Gray. I mean, the color Sonic Gray. As you guys have been asking me for a car tour all over social media ever since I said I got a car, so that's what we're going to be doing today. I've never filmed one of these. It's going to be hella awkward. You saw the decorating portion, well, like decorating, but like putting the essentials in my car because I don't, I don't believe in decorating my car because I need to drive, not make shit look cute just yet. But we're gonna go ahead and start, so come on over. This is my car right now. The name of my car is Henry Caesar. Henry Caesar the Honda Civic, but my sister says I need to name it feminine name or like more female name because she said it's too powerful to have a male name. No sure. So if you have any other name suggestions, let me know. Maybe Haley. Sharp? <laughs> oh, I just knocked the camera. Or Oops. Chase. Not Chase. Hamza? Not Chase. Not Kirk Why are all their names start with H and C? One, since this is the sport model, it's not complete leather, but all my seats have like cloth with like late lace. Leather on the uh, certain parts of it. So this is where my seat is at. If you make fun of how fucking far up it is, you can kiss my natural ass because I need to be able to see. But this is what it looks like. Um, this is just the car door. I keep an umbrella over here, you know? It's like the light isn't focusing, so you look a little bright. Okay, so this is just what the inside looks like. Um, I have an all black interior. I think they only have black interiors for the 2021 Civics if I'm not mistake oh. i don't know this is what it looks like um i have my debt this is the debt how do you not know why are you <laughs> asking me was that a question so this is what it looks like i have like my safety features so like if i start drifting there's features for that i can like limit the amount of space i have on the car in a row with like buttons like this this is all the shit i'm still learning like all the specs and stuff up under here oh it's real close <laughs> So like up under here is where the car chargers are pretty awkward But that's just where they decided to put it for the car and then here's like my brake my gas is what they look like I'm not gonna push any of them because I really don't want to make my placement worse because I have to pull into the garage in a little bit This is just what the interior looks like. It's just like black. Okay back to back to my cam <laughs> Okay, so just in here. I have you know, like my typical mirror that comes in every um, I have my garage door open up here. Um, I have this little tree black ice thing because that's my favorite car smell. I have my car mount for when I start recording in my car. Yeah, I have my, uh, what is this? Glove, this is the glove, that's the glove, but whatever, armrest. I have my armrest right here. Should I be like showing? Yes. Maya, <laughs> go back. Okay, I can't, okay. I'm too, like, I can't. <laughs> it's fine. 
No, this makes me nervous. Okay, so in my car, I literally just have like a black ice little trees up here because it's my favorite car scent. Um, I have my camera mount up here, so when I do start recording the car, it's there. I have a bunch of like these safety features and buttons and shit that I have to like learn where- This is to be a joke. I do not believe this is happening. I'm literally about to f Everything in here is a black interior. I don't know why they only have black interiors for the Civics, but I'm not mad because that's what I wanted anyway. I have my cup holders. They slide up and down. So like if I wanted to get out the car without bringing my wallet, I could just put it under there and boop. Whoa. Boop. So that's a cool thing that I like about this. And then I just have like my econ button and like this brake hold feature. Um, and then I just keep my keys up here in the front right under this marvelous thing with the Honda link and the smartphone connection, all that shenanigans. Um, and then in my glove box, I just keep like extra mask and shit like that. Because I mean, when you go out, you, re you really can't go out with a fucking mask right now. Like I really don't have it in here. So if you were looking for like an extremely cool decorate my car and like car tour, I'm sorry. Oh, we just don't have that here. I'm gonna jump in the back real quick just to show y'all what it's like. But I just yeah. have like my garbage can over there. And then if we move towards the trunk, I have the hatchback version of this car. So I just have the hatchback trunk and literally in my trunk, all of okay. it. The car still so damn new. I have the And don't try nothing with that license plate. First of all, the license plate is disposable. It's my temporary, so don't even do it. I just keep like my car vacuum back here. Um, and in this bag, I just have shit that I keep in my car, like a lint roller, hand sanitizer. I have like deodorant, a toothbrush. I definitely have to put an extra pair of clothes in here because you, even though I doubt my, my car would ever break down, you just never know. So like extra clothes in here would be a good idea. And I also have extra space and an extra tire under here. Dang. Yeah, this, 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 where did that come? this is a big ass trunk for a hatchback. That's the, that's, that's the, that's the whole thing. <laughs> that's a wide back girl all right well oh <laughs> you're scaring them away anyway bring it around town okay so the lighting looks oh my god what does it look like that so i basically filmed my entire how to get a car like tutorial and like tips not tutorial but like tips in this lighting and i realized i didn't like it so we're gonna talk about it in a second after i move my car all right great i have to pull this car back into the garage so that's where we're gonna do it. i was literally going down like my street i don't jump curves often but i literally jumped the curve. uh i'm gonna go we can go live while i take my photos and then like our car leave Purr. it's still recording yeah, it's still recording. I just want to show the girlies that I can, in fact, drive. This car is too attractive to have a male name. Ever since Maya said that, I can only see me having a female name for my car now. Because it's like... She and she wanted a name to start with an H. I said Harriet Tubman, but... She said... <laughs> Girl! I just name it like a name that isn't a people name. Like... Rocky or something. Rocky? Okay, so I just brought my car into the garage and the lighting in here is way better. So I'm just gonna refilm part of this. And before anybody tries to say anything about my car being on in the garage, I one didn't even close the garage door all the way in two. I turned my car off after about sitting here for about two minutes. So before all the cameras come on my comments, I did not try to kill me or my sister. And yes, I know what CO poisoning is. Thank you. Basically what I was saying earlier was a lot of people were asking me to do a how I bought a card 18 video i feel like it doesn't need a whole video to take because my three main points are have a source of income save 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 and either have good credit or have a really good co-signer with really good credit because when it comes to buying cars credit plays a big part in how much you're going to be paying thank god my mom set herself up for goodness because her credit is my chef's kiss almost perfect babe and because of that uh the way my financing is set up on my car um i personally have a 60 month thing but when you do a longer thing for like your car payment so like the longer and it takes for you to pay off the more you're paying because of interest and stuff i have a 60 month or 48 month thing but i'm going to be paying it off in at least 18 months because that's just how i decided to do it and it's easier i get it over with and faster and i am financing my car not leasing it so this will become my car when i finish paying it off literally without my source of income which is youtube sponsors merchandise all that shenanigans i would not be able to buy a car like literally without y'all this is our car like this is our i'm having a source of income and save 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 you can ask maya i literally what? a roman the holiday <laughs> definitely if you have a source of income uh definitely save 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 or save as much as you can i was blessed enough and literally just able to save all my money because i have such a wonderful job that gives me so much flexibility and it's very generous with its money which is why i was able to buy a new car at 18. people are probably going to ask me how did you know like which car you wanted to buy so this was after years of research i think i started looking for cars when i was 16 or at least looking into cars and i always knew i wanted a honda but i always kept my options open when it came to nissans and toyotas and stuff like that but i always really much 
had my heart set on a Honda because Hondas last for fucking ever. Like, I'm pretty sure my child would be able to have this car if it lasts long enough. It comes to figure out which car you want to buy, definitely look at the time of the year. End of the year is always the best time to buy a car because the deals they have going on, they have to get rid of inventory. Earlier, I think I said earlier in the video, I'm not sure, but I was definitely going to get a 2020 Honda Civic at first simply because of the deals that they had on the cars because since it's the end of the year and 2020 is about to be over, they want to get rid of the inventory for the newer models, which is the 2021. So when it comes to buying a car, definitely look at the time of year if you are paying yourself. Definitely end of year is always better. It gives you the cute little Christmas gift, you know what I'm saying? Is there anything else that I, had to say. I think that's it for today's video guys thank you so much for always watching my videos like literally without y'all i would not be able to buy stormy bolt or rocky y'all will know next time we're in the car <laughs> yeah we, yeah y'all you we see i feel like rocky yeah I like fits that, man. rocky or bolt i feel like rocky just fits it better yeah, i feel like stormy's like very not generic but like <laughs> not too much on like, stormy webster like we got what if it's storm rocky Blue? Yes! I love, yes! Stream <laughs> you for on HBO Max on Roku TVs today! <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching all my videos and supporting me because without you, I would not be able to get Stormy Rocky. Y'all will know by the end we of the video. Know. Surprise name reveal at the end of today's video. Thank you so much for always supporting me because literally without you, I would not be able to get this beautiful specimen that is Storm, Stormy, Rocky, or both. I really like Rocky. We're gonna deal with that later. Okay. Literally without you guys, I would not be able to buy this beautiful specimen that is my car. This is our car because you spent the time to watch me and I had to save the money so we could can all go to the store together now and go to starbucks we go to duncan mcdonald's all because y'all watch my videos for hours on end like that 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 hits home babes i could watch anybody and you watch her wide back never <laughs> um, not my wide back y'all chose me to watch and give a car to bitch off the road miss, <laughs> miss mega mind but literally without y'all will not be able to get this car so now we're gonna have to go somewhere every fucking video anyway thank you guys so much for watching today's video if you enjoyed it uh, please give a huge thumbs up down below and subscribe down there while you're damn tired subscribe to the channel subscribe to the channel while you're down there because i feel like uh because of y'all i need to step my shit up like y'all gave me a car i need to give you better videos i don't know how you haven't unsubscribed yet but uh that being said make sure to follow my socials so you can see more of the baby back and miss big back who drives it and uh i will see you guys in the next one stay cool bye guys